Yikes. <laughs> Hey guys, if you guys are new here, my name is Jess and welcome to another video. I am just vlogging my day and then also I wanted to do like a little bit of like motivational stuff, but I'll incorporate it into the video. But anyway, I was watching Adeline Morin earlier and she basically like listed off things like how to be confident and she said like fake it till you make it and I solely believe in that, that you have to fake it until you make it. It. even though I am an introvert I do like try to go out and actually like introduce myself to people and sometimes I'll be like asking myself like oh what would this person do act like I am not shy but at the same time sometimes I'll just like talk and ramble and yeah so I'm trying to not be such an introvert because I don't want to put myself out there as like rude so I just like to talk and be the first one to talk or something and like just get to know people and I feel like I do that through Instagram and like social media and stuff too because I just like I put myself out there more and I'll like type a message I feel like it's easier for me to type something than to verbally speak to someone does that make sense? yeah so anyway I was in the middle of changing because Rex just slobbered all over the sweater I was wearing and then I was like I'm gonna vlog today too because I have to post tomorrow so if this video is late tomorrow that's because you know uh, yeah okay so right now I am am trying to email some brands and then I also have an article to finish and then I need to post another TikTok. I already posted a reels earlier and I posted one TikTok but I am going to post another one so I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay and then another thing that I noticed I have to work on is like prioritizing my time. Sometimes when I'm really focused on something and like doing something I forget to eat, I forget to drink something and then I realize that I'm hungry and then I, I end up going to snack on something which I shouldn't be doing. I think that's like a really bad way to like you know but also I feel like I could just find something in the fridge and just make it and I don't know I just really have like not that I'm really bad at prioritizing my time but like I just feel like when I'm really really focused on something like I have to get it done and I want to get it done and then I forget to like eat or drink something right now I'm gonna go grab a green juice and I'm gonna drink it while I finish editing my videos for TikTok and like I say in every single video, if you guys haven't already, go follow me on Instagram and TikTok and come hang, watch my videos, watch my stories. I post pretty often on there as well, so see you guys there. I also realized that I am kind of bad at replying to my comments, but I promise I am trying to get to them. I'll try to get to them as soon as I can. Okay, another thing that I have not done is make a media kit. So I'm doing that right now and I did like a lot of research on TikTok. TikTok is literally your best friend when you're making a media kit. If you guys don't know what a media kit is, it's basically a resume for like all the things that you've done for content creation. Yeah, I think I'm almost done. I need to replace the photos. Obviously I use a template on Canva and I'm not going to show it because I feel like mine's not that great until I actually perfect it then I might share with you guys but from whatever obstacle you need to learn from whether it's you know your childhood maybe your parents didn't give you a lot of attention when you were younger feeling the need to have validation and, and being gravitated towards people who don't necessarily give you as much attention it all starts with a child and a child fucked up I've read so many books about it oh my god there's this book getting the love that you deserve or something like that our parental figures or whoever raised us we tend to gravitate towards partners that are similar to them to prove to ourselves that we're worthy of love how fucked up is that I don't like to think about it too much because it gives me a little bit of a headache but <laughs> it's true what are you eating? Took a bite of Giselle's muffin. Oh. Giselle doesn't eat that. Rex was playing with it. Yeah. Yeah. That's Shrek lens. I didn't push the bottom. Okay. It's the 2022 quarters. Ow. Let me 
me see. That's a 2022 quarter. Do you look at the difference in them? I know that. I know what a regular quarter looks like. Look at Kevin just showed me a 2022 quarter. That's so cool. Rex just dropped his bone on my foot. That hurts so bad. I was in the middle of getting ready. And then I did a TikTok. Yeah, I was trying to do this transition. And now Kevin's being a loud butt. I thought this was a pimple, but I think it's a scar. Oh no. Yes. <laughs> what are you waiting for? Nothing. So, I'm doing something a little different. Ways to be confident. What else? Think of oh, a, a way, way to be confident. Don't give a fuck what other people think. Okay, that works too. Be happy with who you are and shake what your mama gave you. <laughs> <laughs> and stop comparing yourself. Is that shake how you shake? Shake what your mama gave you. <laughs> <laughs> Twerk wrong. But like, mm, mm, mm. Okay. <laughs> okay. I finished putting my makeup on and was trying, I don't know if this video is going to go very well or smoothly or anything, but I wanted to like vlog and then like throughout the day, I'll give like little tips and tricks on maybe some motivation, some things. I don't know. I need motivation and sometimes I also like self-sabotage myself and think that I overthink every single video and then I delete the clip and then I end up not posting. So that's another thing I need to work on. Um, I guess that's a weakness that I I have is like I also have like imposter syndrome thinking that like oh I'm not good enough to like vlog but also you guys love watching my videos so thank you I appreciate you guys I'm super grateful that you're still here watching every watching every single one of my videos another way to be confident is listing out your strengths and weaknesses because I've been doing that while I'm journaling and I feel like I feel a little bit better about myself and another thing is like making a little collage of your goals every single month and I want to start doing that I don't know. We'll see. When is February? We still have two weeks. Two weeks till February. <laughs> Another thing is like planning out your days. Like I write in my planner. I write in it every single day now. I have been writing in it every single day now. And I feel like it's better now that I'm actually planning out my days. Another thing, a confident person would never bring another person down. And I have noticed this. Like the hottest, prettiest, most confident girl in the world would not judge another girl because of what they look like or what they're doing and I feel like I worked on that a lot like I've changed a lot before I used to be like super jealous of other girls like how pretty they are but now I'm just like yes I love it and it just makes me happy and I always compliment all my social media friends and they're always so pretty and I love it and I'm not jealous of them like we are our own person if that makes sense like Kevin said um <laughs> shake what your mom gave you um, what else? Oh, another thing is self-deprecating jokes. I have notes on my phone. Um, your brain can't tell the difference between what's a joke and what's not a joke. Like saying, oh my god, I'm so stupid. Like, don't say that because your brain can't tell the difference or else you're actually going to think that. So don't think it or say it because if you say it, you're going to start thinking it. Um, start saying more like positive things like, oh, I am beautiful. I am a great vlogger. Your brain is going to start thinking that. And I feel like it goes hand in hand with like manifesting and all that. I am not... <laughs> the person to talk to about manifesting i've just watched videos and like learned throughout the years but these are what tips i have for you guys hopefully you can take it maybe take it with a grain of salt or you can take my advice i don't know oh another thing is treating your body more with love like taking care of yourself i noticed that if you eat like crap then you're going to feel like crap but if you're like eating more like home cooked meals for me i look forward to cooking sometimes sometimes i do get lazy and i don't want to cook but I do look forward to cooking and I cook almost every night. I'm not saying every single night, but almost every night. And I love it. Oh my god, there's a little pair. Oh, there's parakeets. They're so cute. Okay. It's like, look, that's my bone. This is cute too. Ow. Okay. Ow. Coming from a Gemini. What's another way? Your doggy was. Not to care. Because that's, that's the only way to be confident, is not to give a shit. Oh my god, that's not the only that's way. That's the Gemini way. Okay, whatever. Other Geminis might not say the same thing, but... Fine. <laughs> to be confident, just work hard towards your goals. To be confident? <laughs> work hard. If you work hard, you put in the work. Okay. <laughs>
Okay, I might go to the gym or I might go to the sauna. I don't know what I'm doing, but I want to close out the video before I forget. I always tend to forget to like close out the video. So if I don't vlog later, I want to close out the video right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you liked this video, I'm pretty sure my LOS as well. So like and subscribe to my YouTube bestie. I hope you guys really like this kind of different thing that I'm doing. A little motivation. Hopefully this motivates you. And it's still January. I feel like this year so far is going a little bit slower than the other years. And I kind of like it. Don't get me wrong. I like it a lot. <laughs> I feel like time's not flying by as fast as before. Anyway, don't forget to click on the post notification bell so that way you guys get notified whenever I upload. And I hope you guys have a lovely day or a lovely night whenever or whenever or wherever you guys are watching this. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Also, the Chainsmokers have a brand new song called Make Me Feel. I hear Giselle yelling at Rex because he's jumping, as always. <laughs> he gets pretty jumpy. And then, oh, Miley's new song as well. I like this song as well.